What's good, guys? If you want cheap, fast, and reliable NBA 2K20 My Team coins, head on over to NBAsafe.com and use code BUGS for 5% off at checkout. What's up, guys? If you want cheap, fast, and reliable MT, and you want to get those spotlight challenges done, hit up my new sponsor, DVDJ, and use code YOURBOYBUGS for 10% off at checkout. And yeah, man, check them out. What's good, YouTube? It's your boy Bugs back on another NBA 2K20 My Team video. And guys, today, if you do not know, I pulled Pink Diamond Giannis. And yes, the market is crashed. We're going to go over that. If you guys could please drop a like on the video, sub if you were new, that would be greatly appreciated. And man, crazy stuff's going on. And if you guys don't follow my Twitter down below, make sure to go follow that. And yeah, before we get in this video, we're going to run this ad. If you're looking to buy a stacked NBA 2K account with max badges and more, visit sportstmb.com. He has been in the community for years and has hundreds of reviews. Click the first link in the description to get your account today. And right now, bro, there's a lot to talk about. So we're going to talk about the market. If you guys didn't check out the Yadas gameplay, please go check it out. So first off, one thing I want you guys to focus on is trying to snipe this guy right here. Because he's actually really good. I actually pulled him in one of my first packs. And then I pulled a couple more packs and pulled Giannis. It was insane. Pulled him in a pack. So uh, yeah, man. Um, honestly, this card's really good. I would try recommend sniping him. He's really, really good. Probably a really good card to snipe. I just sold him for 53k not too long ago. But yeah, this card's really good. So if I were you, I would probably stick on this filter and try sniping him. He's probably going to get posted up for a really cheap a lot. He's a really good card. People are going to use him. So one snipe filter I would recommend. We're pretty much going to go over a bunch of snipe filters and methods to make MT. As you can see, there's a ton getting posted. So, oh, I botched it. Oh, my God. As you can see, man, right there. I'll take that one. Wow, bro. Right there, man. So as you can see in the video, I just botched the 2100 snipe um yeah people are gonna post this card off for really cheap it's gonna be snipes like snipes like crazy so i would recommend trying to snipe this card i'm actually so tired i just missed that i like dude are you kidding me you just see how slow i was on that so yeah definitely try sniping out this card try sniping out the michael ray richardson and like seriously this is probably one of the best methods i got right now anything in the new flash content like literally if you want as well uh you could try sniping in the new john walls a lot to snipe but yeah, we'll be right back with you one sec. Real quick, I just want to tell you, the best snipe builder, in my opinion, right now, real quick, before I go over all the snipe builders, in my opinion, is Amethyst. I straight up say, it's either this one or the Diamond Filter. If you guys want to make MT fast, try out this snipe filter. It's probably one of the best ones. Like, straight up, this is definitely going to be one of the most consistent snipe builders in the game right now. Oh, I just missed it. Oh, no man see that's what i'm saying so you can make a lot of mt on this filter i really recommend trying it and um dude try it out let me know i'll be right back with you all righty so we got the tips let's go over some tips like literally I, I i don't even know i pulled Giannis. i can't control myself i'm still in shock from the poll i'm not selling him i now have glitch lebron glitch uh, galaxy will curry and glitch Giannis. like i mean i don't know what to do my team stacked. I know I, I say it enough. Go check out that damn Giannis gameplay. We're going to get into some tips, some snipe filters for you guys, some people to invest in. First, I want to say invest. If you can, try to snipe out John Wall. I feel like he's going to be a good card to invest in. Andre Kernelenko is going to be dirt cheap, in my opinion. They also just drop new challenges no one really cares about. But, yo, before we do get into these tips, we'll pull one more pack. And then we're going to pull a Galaxy over real quick. So, here we go. Oh, oh my god i thought i'll pull nah that's it we're done i accidentally just sold out for one mt what are we gonna do so let's get into it so right now man honestly if you did sell your team like i told you guys to and you listen to me you're gonna make a lot of mt like you could pretty much buy bronzes and make mt anything that your heart desires personally i was looking at chris bosh's price and i really think he's a good card to buy like a really, really good card to buy right now is definitely Chris Bosch, considering the fact he's that cheap. And he was 120k plus the whole entire year until what? They dropped those super packs. So in my opinion, he's a really good card. He's my starting center. I could get a lot better center, but he's one of my favorite centers in the game. And for the low price of what? 60 something K? In my opinion, man, he's such a must cop. 
68k for Bosch. He's so damn good. I think his price will rise to around 80 something k. Very good card to pick up. Same with Larry Bird, man. Larry Bird is so damn good. His jumper's money. I still use him. My team's really good. I still think Larry Bird is a very, very good threat. A very big threat in this game. And also, man, for 75k, which I am getting that real quick. That's a little bit of a snipe. I just got Larry Bird for 75k. He's going for around 85. I think he'll go back up to 100k. If you do want to do the Dwight Howard set, now is probably your best time to do so. I'm thinking about it. I might do it. Pretty much anything you guys want to do. Some snipe filters I do recommend. The diamond snipe filter is really good considering there is the flash packs. The flash set four. I just missed the big Z if you guys didn't see. For 2k. So diamond filter is going to be really money. Any pink diamond filter is going to be money. 500 filter is going to be money. Pretty much every filter in the game. Like this filter right here straight cash like everything should be popping up every second um just misses a bonus for 600 he goes for around thousand i would recommend staying on this filter the amethyst filter amethyst 20 filter whatever your heart desires man like straight up galaxy opal filter pretty much you could just invest in your butt bro you can invest in absolutely nothing and make mt at this point um market is way down galaxy opal filter is probably one of the best filters in the game with another Colonel Lenko drop. The glitch filter isn't that bad either. I'm just going over a ton of filters. Personally, I like the lower tier filters, but it's up to you guys. Lower tier filters, in my opinion, are always better. They're always better. Always better. And I don't understand why, but every glitch card's always an OP point guard, if you guys haven't realized. Like it's never like a like a, a shooting guard. Like imagine there was a Giannis with point guard shooting guard. I rather run Giannis at shooting guard than point guard. Or no. I rather like if it was LeBron at point guard shooting guard, I would run LeBron at shooting guard and Giannis at point. That would be sick. I don't know. That's just me. Or Giannis at shooting guard, whatever it is. But Giannis is OP. If you guys didn't check out that gameplay, please go check it out. Also, some investments, bro. Whatever you guys want to invest in, whatever your heart desires, whatever's low, invest. I mean, there's just so much to invest in. It's super, it's just up to you. Like you could pretty much invest in your like I said, you can invest in anything. Um, but also the big Z card, what's his name? I don't know how to say his name, but this card is honestly one of the best cards to snipe. He has a lot of value. So you could probably snag some some of him for like 20 something K. I would definitely recommend trying to snipe out this card. One of the best cards to snipe out in the game. Um, if you want, if you're a big baller, you could try sniping out Glitch Giannis. If you snipe out Glitch Giannis, let's check his price. Cause yo, I kind of want to sell mine, but nah, I can't. Um, Glitch Giannis. So let's go glitch bucks and um it's not, i'm never putting galaxy oval glitch bucks here it is 770k if you snipe Giannis, bro you're an mt millionaire so if i were you i would probably sit on this filter all day if you get a Giannis, bro if you get 500 000 mt profit off of Giannis, you know how much money that is if you sell that mt you're gonna make like a hundred dollars 500k mt is going for almost a hundred dollars on xbox so it's crazy stuff man like let me know what's the deal let me know if you guys do snipe anything right now i'm just crazy i literally don't understand how i snipe Giannis. i i'm still in shock if you guys wondered this is my team it could be a lot better this is just a team i like to run with I mean, dude, this Giannis, bro, is so good. Zion's been playing really good for me. Also, man, Zion's back to a buyout. If you guys want to pick up Zion, it's not a bad idea. And also, if you guys want, make sure to drop, like, questions and stuff in the comments. I'll answer them. Zion's about to be a bit again. If you guys want to get him for 100K, now is probably your last chance. Galaxy Opal D Rose at 170. This is probably your best time to get your Opals. Best time to buy your team. Pretty much if you buy your team and if you wait till Sunday, the cards are going to go up. The, the prices are going to go up a ton. If you want to pick up Diamond Bam, which I'm actually about to do, everything's really cheap, man. Pretty much buy your whole team now and thank me later. But yeah, that's really all I got for the video. I hope you guys enjoyed. Investments, all that good stuff. Let me know. Let me know what you guys are looking to invest in. I want to hear your what you guys think. And yeah, that's really all I got. I hope you guys did enjoy the video. Have a good one. Peace.